Hello everyone, welcome. The present work aims to evidence the contribution that existing materials and constructive techniques can provide for sustainable development in the construction sector, supporting innovative and eco-friendly techniques and processes that reduce environmental impact, identifying the reasoning for preservation of the natural resources and endorsing the use of renewable energies. The current consumption rate of fossil fuels and natural resources in the construction activities is unsustainable. The aim of the project is about designing a passive zero energy house containing a climate of life structure. The solution should be within the requirements of a net zero energy building. Modular housing construction allows a variety of alternatives and design possibilities, offering a wide range of options to customize the house. Here, there is a description of the materials chosen for the Echo House. As we can notice, all of them are recycled. Now I present a more detailed overview of the wall section. The quantity of the material used in the Echo House will further on help us understand the energy that is used for its construction. The same study for the floor and the roof. The next step to take in consideration are the design strategies concerning the passive systems. The natural ventilation strategy relies on two different approaches, natural ventilation achieved by the windows and allowing the natural movement of the wind, and a passive cooling system using buried pipes. The Echo House will be also provided with a photovoltaic system and solar thermal panels for the hot water needs. It is also crucial to have a saving system for the house in order to store the rainwater, allowing it to reuse. On this image, we can see the location of the different equipments. Now, the aim of this analysis is to evaluate the amount of CO2 released to the atmosphere in the manufacture and construction phase in order to evaluate the environmental efficiency. As it was already referred, CO2 emissions change from one material to another, mainly depending on the embodied energy. Currently, the purpose is to analyze how much CO2 is released, correlating the emissions value already known for manufacture and construction process, excluding transportation, with the material mass needed for built the Echo House. In 2011, electric energy produced in Portugal has been generated from renewable energies, natural gas, coal and other thermal sources. Information was crucial to calculate the savings for the Echo House. In conclusion, the model analyzed and presented on this video shows the effective sustainable measures and strategies with potential results face the traditional standard models. The architect plays an essential role in the promotion of these sustainable practices and concepts during all the project phases.